In this example, we will see how we can split the string into coding language name. And for that, we will take help of split method here. But first of all, we need to check whether this string supports the split method or not. And to know about the member method and properties of an object, we can take help of get member commandlet. So pipe get member hit enter. And here we can see split method is there. So we can use that. So let's write here. And here we will need for each object commandlet to perform operation on each item. So mention for each object. Okay. Now we have to declare the split method. So we will use member name parameter to specify the split method. Member name and mention the method split. And we will use argument list parameter to identify the dot as the split delimiter. So give argument list. Okay. And mention dot as the split delimiter. Hit enter. And here we can see the coding language name has been printed on the console. The another way to perform the same action will be instead of writing this member name and argument list, let us use the traditional syntax which includes a script block and the current object operator. Okay. And and let's use the dot and the split method. Close the block and hit enter. And here we can see coding language names has been printed on the console. 